Hi, my name is Brennan Grimes and today we're going to be diving into the world of niche construction. So what is niche construction you might ask? Niche construction is any way in which an organism changes its own environment in order to cause natural selection. These changes create an advantage for organisms with certain traits within their own population. So let me give you an example. If you live in America, you probably know a few people that are lactose intolerant. This means that at some point during infancy, their bodies stop transcribing the lactase enzyme, which is the main enzyme responsible for breaking down the main sh sugar in milk, lactose. While it might not seem like it, people who are lactose tolerant are actually in the minority worldwide. According to the U.S. National Library of Medicine, all mammals, including humans, are supposed to stop producing the lactase enzyme shortly after infancy. This means that somewhere along the way, there must have been a mutation that occurred that is allowing humans to continue digesting milk well into adulthood. This mutation meant that the body never stopped transcribing the lactase enzyme and that adults could digest milk. However, for a mutation to survive and become prominent within a species, it must provide some sort of advantage over organisms without that mutation. So what gives? Why was milk so important? If you remember from history class, Areas like Northern Europe frequently utilized cow's milk in their daily lives. It became a key part of their society. In times of famine, these societies greatly leaned on milk to give them the essential nutrients and protein that they needed to survive. If people were lactose intolerant, they were less likely to survive because the milk actually harmed them. Being lactose tolerant made you more likely to survive, and the more likely you are to survive, the more likely you are to reproduce, which means the mutation is going to be passed on from generation to generation. If you examine a map of lactose intolerant worldwide, you will see that America and Northern Europe have the lowest proportion of people that are still lactose intolerant. On the contrary, areas like North Africa and Asia are almost exclusively lactose intolerant because their early societies did not lean on milk quite so heavily and they were never forced to develop lactose tolerance. So, humans in certain areas created a cause for natural selection within their own environments. They constructed their own niche. This is essentially driving our own evolution. And while it may seem like a small development, just imagine how our actions today are affecting our DNA tomorrow. Thanks for watching.